Hi, I'm Mike Van Kempen, one of the managing partners at Sum Ventures based out of our Chicago office. I've been fortunate enough to see what it takes to bring a company from inception to a multi-billion dollar exit. My name is Garrett Gilbertson, and I'm the founder and managing director of Sum Ventures. Garrett is a truly exceptional um, investor, and I basically roll along with anything that Garrett gets involved with, so I couldn't be happier to be involved with Sum. Um, it's just a, a, a great opportunity with a great initial portfolio of companies that are just hitting it out of the park. My mission with Sun Ventures is to deliver superior returns for our LPs and help the next generation of founders build the future of banking, financial services, and real estate technology. To accomplish this mission, I built an incredible team to help me source, diligence, and accelerate the growth of our portfolio companies. Mike Van Kempen, Peter Mansfield, and Peter John all bring incredible track records as successful entrepreneurs and investors. While I love building, one of the biggest joys that I get is working with and helping others solve complex problems that will change the world. That's why I'm moving from the operating side of things to the venture side, where I can partner with Garrett to invest in visionary founders. I also wanted to highlight our past portfolio founders, partners, and share with you my journey to launching this fund. In 2016, I became the youngest member to join the Band of Angels. The band is the oldest angel investor group in the world, based in Silicon Valley. I am Sonia Markova, executive director of uh, Band of Angels. About his approach uh, to venture funding is that he has built uh, a wonderful relationships with a number of stakeholders in the venture ecosystem, uh, both in Southern California and uh, Silicon Valley. And he discovers founders early, oftentimes provides the seed capital. Uh, he works with them on uh, business plan uh, execution and uh, when they're ready for their seed round, introduces them to uh, the band and other funding partners so they can uh, complete their round. Uh, he's also an advisor, uh, board member, and um, is really with uh, the founders uh, for the journey. Through his efforts, we've uh, discovered a number of innovative startups. We've invested in some, such as uh, Brias, Unest and uh, Clear Club. I was introduced to Garrett. Uh, he invested in the company, and after that, he introduced us to the Band of Angels, and I got involved too. And we started the fundraising process together. He was very helpful um, from the beginning with the deck and uh, helping me, uh, coaching me through this process. And we ended up raising more than two million. Now we're over thirty thousand customers and we have more than $200,000 uh, in revenue per month. So very excited about uh, what's going on in this year and continue rolling with Startup Mavericks. I'm James Ratton, co-founder of Brius Technologies, and I'm a startup maverick. Just as some background, Brius is a medical device company that manufactures a new type of orthodontic treatment that significantly reduces treatment time and doctor visits, among other advantages, and it mainly does that through independent teeth movement. When Startup Mavericks uh, invested, uh, that was back in uh, early 2019, uh, the note was uh, 10 million cap, and then uh, within a few months, we raised an additional capital uh, with 15 million, which Startup Mavericks helped us raise. And then around six months after that, uh, we raised a 15 million A round at a 40 million post money. Um, and, and during the angel round, which Startup Mavericks was a big part of, uh, we had a lot of well-known investors, which Garrett helped us find. Fred Mall was one, um, and then a whole bunch of people from Sondra Capital. And then Sondra Capital actually went on to lead the, the A round, uh, along with Invis Opportunities. Um, and uh, we're actually happy to be raising our B round this year. Uh, so I hope uh, Startup Mavericks will be able to follow on. Ksenia Yudina. I'm a CEO and founder of UNAST. Um, so the company is based in LA and our mission is to help parents build a better future for their kids by democratizing access to cost-efficient financial solutions for parents. So Garrett was one of our earliest investors um, and since he joined the company, uh, the company valuation increased from 6 million to 120 million. Uh, we just closed our Series B last year um, and I also asked uh, Garrett to join the board of directors because he was extremely helpful um, at the early stages of the company. During my time as an investor, my focus has always been on investing in people first. Ultimately, we only know a small piece of what a seed stage company will become. 
It is the founder who will navigate the often treacherous waters that determine the success of the company. Hi, I'm Kevin Simring, co-founder and CEO of Paperwork, a mobile first financial wellness platform that helps people organize and take control of their financial lives. Startup Mavericks uh, or Sun uh, invested in our company very early on, in fact, at the pre-seed stage. Um, but the truth is I actually met Garrett uh, before our pre-seed um, and I instantly knew that I, that I wanted to work with Garrett. We were fortunate enough uh, for Garrett to join our advisory board at that point very early on. Um, and he's just added uh, an incredible amount of value. So um, Kickstart Fund out of Utah was our lead VC investor in, in our seed round with follow-on participation from Launchpad Capital based in the Bay Area who participated in our pre-seed as well. And then our uh, third investor was AARP uh, Innovation Lab, so a fantastic partner to, to have on board together with Sun as well who participated in that round. We got uh, Startup Mavericks on board and Garrett invested in Automotive's back uh, in early 2021, I want to say. He invested a $5 million pre-money valuation. Since then, we've really taken off. At the time, we had one pilot with the city of Bellevue in the U.S. and then two pilots in Europe with cities of Turin and Paris. Since then, we've expanded to cities like Santa Monica, Los Angeles, San Francisco, Miami, Boston, Omaha, Austin, and many more. Uh, largely due to uh, the help that Garrett and his team provided in raising additional capital that enabled us to grow and continue to be successful in the early days. Since becoming the executive director of LAVA, I've had the privilege to meet angels, VCs, private equity, many investors. But one particular investor has stood out to me for his tireless efforts to be everywhere at once. Not only is he a member of the Pasadena Angels, and the Tech Coast Angels, but he's also a director of the LA chapter of the Band of Angels. And at any given time, his firm startup Mavericks is assisting at least a half a dozen to a dozen lucky founders. Over the past 18 months, he's invested in the earliest stages of a number of promising startups, some of which have already been successful at raising their next rounds. And recently, he's been instrumental in helping me develop Lava's invite only Angel VC series syndication events. I can't think of a better, more appropriate person to receive our Outstanding Angel Award for outstanding activity in the angel community than Garrett Gilbertson. These accolades are a testament to the incredible founders and partners I've been able to work with. I've served on the boards of amazing companies like Unest, DressX, Clear Club, and Paperwork. I'm also an advisor to Champions Round, Giving, Sensei, Brias, Verifier, and Eargreen. I met Garrett a little over two years ago when he joined our company as first an advisor and ultimately an investor. And over the last two years, he's been instrumental in assisting us while we not only find, but ultimately negotiate venture deals. We've been able to close capital from Lead Sports, Adidas, Quest Venture Partners, Band of Angels, and the Schottenstein family office. We have um, Star Mavericks as our investors. We have some strategics like, again, Douglas Element, a publicly traded company, Redwood Trust, another publicly traded company, uh, some other investors from Band of Angels as well. And uh, we're just super excited to see what happens next for both Perlin as well as Startup Mavericks. Garrett has run multiple venture funds and has a proven track record of angel investing. I bring the operating background, working in and advising multiple fintechs and prop techs. The SUM brand has shown over a 233% internal rate of return the last three years. We're excited to kick off the new year with Fund One of SUM Ventures and continuing to build off our successful track record of creating value with visionary founders, now with amazing LPs joining us on this journey. We look forward to partnering with you.